What's up, everybody? It's Diecast Chris here, back again with video number two about the uh, other stuff y'all seen in the first video that I showed you. And let's get on with it. Here is a uh, 61 Impala Walmart exclusive that I found. It's pretty nice. Thought it was really cool. Might open it, do some customization to it. Thought the Hot Wheels logo banner across the windshield looked pretty nice. And I picked up a uh, 62 Chevy with the Hot Wheels logo across the hood. Yeah, I thought maybe I'd do some customization to that one too. Don't see no reason in keeping them in the pack just because they're Walmart exclusives. They don't mean nothing to me like that. But my buddy Mark, man, he hooked me up with uh, this 34 Ford right here. Treasure Hunt from 09 that I needed to complete my 2009 Treasure Hunt set. So I got that one. That one's the regular version. And he hooked me up with this one, brand new, out on the shelves, is the uh, Chevy Cobra CR1 Concept. Yeah, it's a pretty nice piece, man. I don't particularly care for the color or the wheels on it, but it's still a nice looking car. But it'll be going on the wall right over there with the other ones anyway, so. We'll hang it up. And let's get on to some of my custom pieces that I did. This right here is a mystery car. I put some real rider tires on it, painted the interior, which y'all can't see. Uh, thought it turned out pretty nice. It's a 72 Monte Carlo. And did a uh, Firebird here. This is actually a dollar, 88 cent dollar car. I actually uh, took the metal base off of a garage car because I didn't really didn't like the garage car the way it looked. You know, it was kind of crappy color. I just didn't like it, so I put this body on it instead, and it turned out really nice. Looks a lot better, I think. And if you want my opinion, the dollar car has actually got more detail into tampos than the freaking garage car had. Now, how dumb is that? A dollar car with more details than a five dollar car? It's a little crazy. But anyway, there's that one. Customized a uh, Cuda uh, convertible, 426 Cuda convertible from 19... I want to say... 97, 98, somewhere around there. Yeah, the only thing I did to it was put real rider tires on it. That's all I done. Didn't do anything special fancy to it. And here goes another uh, Plymouth Cuda that I customized. I put some real rider tires on this one. Put some five spoke real riders on it. Looks really nice. Turned out really good. And here goes my favorite one. Customized one of these bad boys, Little Red Express. I put some real rider tires on it, painted the interior, dotted out the tail lights and everything. Man, I just wish my camera was better so y'all could see it. But this is my favorite one out of all of them. Man, this thing looks really, really nice. It looks really good, and it rolls really sweet too. But that's it, guys. Hope y'all have fun and watching me uh, babble on about my customs. But y'all have fun, happy hunting, and bye.